Merry Christmas, guys! Uh, thank you so much for clicking on this video. My name is Gina Poldnev, aka Lil Ruski. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok. Make sure to subscribe for new videos every Tuesday at 12 o'clock. At 12. Every Tuesday at 12. So just like a quick little recap before I get into the story time, I had a Christmas dinner with all my friends. I made food for everyone and like we did our little Christmas exchange and um... <laughs> Get you a friend who rhinestones a shirt for you. She rhinestoned custom clothing for all of us. I'm literally screaming like this is so hot. It says krasotka, which basically means like haughty in Russian. I just have the best friends and I'm so thankful for them. So I also want to show you guys my house because you think y'all go full out on Christmas You should see my house. So first of all, this is our patio my child sleeping per usual fancy bottle of champagne Yes, the grapevine we got the little stockings. We got all this stuff. My dinner table. This is literally where I film all my videos. Right over here. Cute. Some elves and snowmen. Then we go over to my living room. I'm gonna turn the light on just so you guys can see better. This little part. Very cute, very fun. Got the couch set up, the lasers, the other couches. Got the little fire stove. We have our Christmas tree set up with all the presents for my friends. If you saw my Christmas runway haul, you already know what's in these. The stairs, which is literally my favorite part. Look how gorgeous that is. And we have the little setup with some more elves. So we're gonna get to the story, folks. I just had to get all that out of the way because I want you to be jealous of my house because we're Christmas bitches. I'm also gonna make the story time kind of a reenactment. In order for you to get the full experience, you need to live vicariously through me, so I'm gonna give a little reenactment. Back then, I was the strongest believer of Santa Claus. You could not convince me otherwise that Santa Claus was not real, especially with the way my childhood was set up. So I did rhythmic gymnastics growing up. If you guys saw my previous videos, you already know this. And every year we would have a Christmas show. And so during the Christmas Christmas show Santa would come and like give everyone presents and I genuinely thought this was the real deal I thought this was Santa Claus it turned out to be my coach's husband. However, Привет, Misha. I truly believed in Santa Claus. All my friends believed in Santa Claus. Normally, people stop believing in Santa Claus at like eight or 10 years old. I think I was either 13 or 14 when I stopped believing in Santa Claus. I had a wild imagination. Shout out to everyone with wild imaginations. Shout out to you, queen. I believed in Santa Claus very much. Like it was my whole life. I was convinced Santa Claus was the one bringing Christmas presents to my house on the 20. Well, technically see the other thing is the first 10 years of my life, I would always get my presents on New Year's because Russian Christmas is New Year's. That didn't weird me out because I was convinced he was real and he was coming into my house and dropping off presents. And my mom was so good at it because I would even put up my phone and I wouldn't even tell my parents about this, but I would put up my phone, film my tree to see if Santa was coming and my mom would literally hide my phone or take it away. She was just so good at it. She was so, so good at it. And so obviously every year I was getting my presents and this one particular year, I was either literally 13 or 14, like very embarrassing, but whatever. Basically, I go up to my mom and I'm like, mom, you never, actually, this is that reenactment. One moment. Wow, my Dad Maroz so much presents. Mom, look, he fell asleep. Here so many presents. Вау! Мама, я просто, я не понимаю, а чего мне Дед Мороз всегда так много подарков дарит, а ты мне никогда не даришь? Вообще, я даже не помню один год, что ты мне подарки когда-то подарила, но мне Дед Мороз всегда так много дарит. Наверное, он меня больше любит, чем ты меня любишь, да? А, да? Тебе Дед Мороз так много подарок дарит, и я тебе ни черта не дарю? Как ты смеешь такое говорить? Вообще-то ты не понимаешь, что это я тебе все эти подарки дарю. Это я тебе все это покупаю и тебе под дерево кладу. Ты меня уже достала с этим. Достала. Это не Дед Мороз, никакой не Санта Клаус тебе дарит эти подарки. Это я тебе дарю. Это я, а не он. Какой-то воздушный мужчина летит, который по какие-то рейндирс. Не, это я, это я тебе дарю. Как ты можешь такое сказать? Это неправда. Я знаю, что Дед Мороз настоящий. И он летит, и все эти дед 
подарки дарит. Как ты можешь такое сказать? Я знаю, что он настоящий. Настоящий, да? Настоящий, этот мужчина тебе дарит подарки, а? Я сейчас тебе ресит покажу. Сейчас я тебе покажу. Что это я все тебе дарю? Вот, смотри. Смотри, это ресит, я тебе показываю. Смотри, видишь, это я тебе все подарки дарю. Это я пошла в Forever 21. Это я пошла в Justice. Это все я тебе дарю. Ты должна уже перестать это верить. Тебе 13 лет уже. Ты большая девочка, ты вообще женщина. Тебе надо вырастить уже. Дедушка Мороз настоящий. Я знаю, что это он. Чего ты такая говоришь? So yeah, that's literally how I found out Santa Claus is not real. I hope you enjoy the low budget reenactment of my mom yelling at me, telling me that she's Santa Claus and that Santa Claus isn't real. You have to understand, guys, I was so innocent when I was younger, especially growing up in the gymnastics community. I was like 13 years old acting like a 10 year old and so were all my other friends, all, all my other gymnastics friends. Like we were so innocent. And I remember distinctly like all my friends, especially my friend Astasia, she probably believed in Santa Claus the most out of all of us. And she convinced me that he was real so much. And so that's how I found out Santa Claus isn't real. For parents who have kids, let them dream on and let them remember their childhood as being one of Santa Claus giving them presents. I think it's really important to have those little memories and it's never forgotten. I really appreciate my mom for doing that for me. But yeah, so this video is obviously gonna be so short. It's probably gonna be like six minutes. But let me know in the comments down below what other videos you'd like me to make. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Let me know what your thoughts are about my reenactment. And also, let me know how you found out Santa Claus isn't real in the comments as well. Because I am incredibly curious. And yeah. 